In this lesson, we're going to take a look at extra fading and how we can use that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and attach an XREF into this drawing. I'm going to attach my second floor plan into this first floor plan. And I'm going to leave all this kind of uh, like it is. And it will bring in my second floor on top of my first floor. Now, in the past, what we would do a lot of times is we would go in and we would change the colors of our second floor plan or our, our X references to be something different so that we could tell them apart from our, our entities that are in this drawing. In this case, the different walls. But you can see in AutoCAD 2010 that you have the ability to, um, you can tell them different because they're faded. The, the X ref slightly faded. Now, the place that you go to adjust this fading is you go to reference. And you see here that uh, when you pull down the little the little arrow to extend this palette, uh, this little panel, we see that we have an option called XREF fading. And we can drag this around, and as we drag it, like if we drag it all the way to zero, it doesn't fade at all, and it's very difficult to tell the drawing, the, uh, my current drawing versus my external reference. So if I come over here to fading, as I increase this value, you see that the plan starts to fade, and if I go all the way over, the, the most it'll let me go is 90%, then it's very obvious what's coming in as an XREF and what's coming in, um, what's already in there. Now, in some areas, it's a little difficult to see, so I'm going to show you another little tip here. If you click on your XREF, your XREF and you right-click, you can go over to Draw Order, and you can tell it to send to back, and it'll move the XREF to the back of the drawing, and so now these lines that are in my main drawing here are in the foreground, and they're not covered up. So that's another way that you want to be sure that you, um, another tip you want to use to make sure that you can kind of tell the difference between your XREF objects and your objects in your main drawing.